So we're going to jump right into your creation dashboard here and show you how to select a module and build out your A plus content layout. So you're just going to select add module and Amazon prompts you with a window that shows you all the different modules you can choose from. There are quite a few here. Just keep in mind, you can only pick seven of them. And if you have other products in your stores, we definitely recommend having a standard practice of having the comparison chart at the bottom of your A plus content. This is really great for upselling or showing the client or customer what other products you have that might either complement uh, the one they're specifically looking for or just other contents in your store. So here the first module is a standard company logo and it has the image size right here, which is really handy. We have a module with four images with crawlable text underneath each image. Same thing here, we have four image options, though the images are slightly smaller and we have four quadrants with crawlable text here. These are probably two of my favorite modules to use. These are just a standard image uh, text module with either a dark or a white overlay box. Uh, it's handy because if you don't fill out these boxes here, you can have a slightly narrower uh, header image. I like to use those for different things. However, definitely take advantage of the crawlable text options because these are separate from the image and can give you SEO value. Here we have another image option or a header image option with some crawlable text underneath. Here is a multi-image uh, layout module where each image that they select comes accompanied with its own independent crawlable text. So those will shift as they select the images, which is super nice. And we have another crawlable text module. And we have some more modules down here with different text options. So you'll see where they can have a description in the middle, bullets to the right, or a description in the middle with bringing out perhaps key features. Uh, this would be really good for kind of telling them about your brand, giving them a little, a little just snippet of a brand story. Here we also have a different layout for breaking up the product details. We have crawlable text here with the image to the left or the right. And then we have a nice uh, product specification module image, which is also super handy for when you're breaking down the details of your product. We have one more crawlable text module, and then we have a standard three images with text options underneath. So I'm just gonna go ahead and start selecting some of these to kind of show you how you can add them. You're just going to click the ones you want. I'm just gonna go ahead and just start clicking here. I won't do all seven, but I wanna show you how easy these are to really set up. All right, and you can see here, the module is going to give you all the details you need. You have your headline here, you have your text body here, and you have editing abilities. Within each module, they'll give you your editing abilities. But just to show you how to move a module, like I had said before, the comparison chart you really want to have at the bottom of your A plus content. So these are really easy to move just by clicking the arrow in the direction that you want to move the module to. You can also easily delete the module if you don't want that module anymore. In your standard comparison chart, you have the option of having up to six. <laughs> Please note you can scroll here. Sometimes people think that there's only five options, but you do have actually six available options to give direct links to other products in your store. You can make them links by entering the ASIN down here, and you have the image size specifications right here. You can have the column that you wanted highlighted by just clicking the little box there. And you can also have up to 10 metrics. That can basically be either comparing the items to each other if they're just different sizes or colors, or it can also just break down the features of what is this product capable of. And then here in the details with under the, the product, you can either have text information or a checkbox, which is super handy. So definitely take advantage of that. I hope this has been helpful to you and I hope you enjoy the rest of the course.